one two pitch. Hit toward third. Castro has it. Spins, fires. A perfect game! Roy Halladay has thrown the second perfect game in Philadelphia Phillies history. He faces 27 batters. He retires all 27. Two outs. Halladay is one strike away. The 0 2. A bouncer. Ruiz. In time! Roy Halladay has thrown a no hitter! Roy Halladay, nicknamed Doc, was a very special Phillies pitcher in 2010. In only a three-year span, he will become Philadelphia's greatest Christmas present in 2009, where he will become a Philly in pinstripes. He was the Phillies' ace from 2010 to 2013, but those games back in 2010, it was something special. Every day in spring training, he would have a pitching session and would come into the workout afterwards soaking wet and also chase up, we thought. It was raining, but no, it was just Roy Halliday's way of saying, I just got my workout in. And Chase Utley said to this day, i never seen anybody like Roy Halliday. The beginning of the memories for Roy Halliday in the 2010 year were iconic. And there were nothing short of amazing, and especially on May 29th, 2010 where the Phillies took on the Florida Marlins. That night where Roy Halladay would strike out hitter after hitter and would do whatever he can to get perfection. As there was two outs in the ninth and a 1-2 count, a grounder up the middle by Juan Castro would throw it to the first baseman, Ryan Howard, in time to get the Marlins pitcher and would throw a perfect game for the second time in Phillies history. That same year in 2010, the Phillies were one game away from clinching the NL East and was also my mom and dad's anniversary on September 27th. Even though the Phillies won the NL East for the fourth consecutive year, the quote was iconic when he talked to Gary Sarge Matthews after the game. And it was a quote that he said, It was fun, but it's only going to get funner. Speaking of funner, the game was funner in the NLDS on October the 6th, where he would make history yet again. This time he will face the Cincinnati Reds. As he will strike out batter after batter like it was in the perfect game on May the 29th, but this time he would go into the knife with two outs. Roy would throw with the pitch, a dribble over the point, Carl Suiz would throw at the first in time to get him, and that will be the first no-hitter in Roy Halladay's history, but the second time in MLB playoff history. Doc was loved in this town by many iconic performances back in 2010, and it was something fun or funner when he took the mound those games and pinstripes, and it surely missed every day in baseball and by so many Phillies fans. Roy Halliday, nicknamed Doc.